How's it going, everybody? Um, it's been a long time. Yes, uh, it's been a long time since I uh, last did a video. Uh, back on the SoCom 4 Open Beta. <clears throat> uh, first, I'd like to say I, um, kind of, um, sorry that I didn't upload anything, but I really wanted to have that video up for a good while so all my subscribers and any future subscribers can or anyone who's been working with the other person I was talking to can really understand what was going on with the whole situ situation with my channel. Uh, as you guys can tell, I've been playing Bad Company 1. I've talked about that in SOCOM 4, and I figured since I'm not going to be able to get any new games, at least I don't think so just yet, um, I figured I might as well record some random, se uh, random session of games. So pretty much I'm going to call... Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to call this thing like the random series. Basically what I'm hoping to do is uh, pretty much record any multiplayer stuff. Like Bad Company 1 multiplayer so you guys can see what that's all about with my commentary. Um, I'll be doing maybe some Killzone 3, some Bulletstorm co-op um, stuff and uh, maybe uh, do some Bad Company 2. And apparently my skill level has went up. <clears throat> Although, yeah, it's kind of odd, the skill level in this game. You only get it when you become the general of the army, which is like the last rank online. <clears throat> you basically give like uh, a scale for 1 to 50, and the w number 1 is the best, 50 is the worst. And if you go up, you your rank comes down, and that means you're playing your best. I've actually lowered my rank from 28 when I first started <clears throat> last month to... As you can tell, 11. Uh, it's shocking because I wasn't really doing much. I wasn't really doing anything different. But yes, this is an instant classic. Anyone who's played first-person shooters and has really, um, it really likes first-person shooters, um, I'm gonna tell you guys right now, in my humble opinion, you gotta buy this game. Um, Xbox 360, PS3, doesn't matter what console you get it on. I recommend this game. It's cheap. You can pot, if we can find it in the, in the stores and bargain bins, like uh, 15 to 20 bucks. Um, you can get the gold edition for the PS3, I think, for $20 too. Um, I'm sure you can do, get the same thing for the 360. This game is fucking awesome. I'll tell you right now, this game is fucking awesome. Honestly, the story mode is awesome. And yes, guys, I will be doing a story mode of this bad boy. Um, I want to say, uh, well, I know I, I don't have a definite date, but I want to do it when I get everything situated with my p new PC and the, new, and the hot page. I really think that's where this game needs to be played truly really most. HD. So, pretty much I'm going to play a match. <clears throat> um, I'm, I'm going to do Gold Rush for this session, and I'm going to do another recession under uh, Conquest, which is pretty much Capture the Flag bullshit. I really don't like, the, oh, um... Conquest as much as uh, Gold Rust, unfortunately. But I'll choose Oasis. I'm not. I'm not gonna get Oasis. I'll probably get like Fally Run or some bullshit. Oh wow, Oasis. That's pretty cool. The one thing about this game, ah, uh, yes, and this is my cat. Uh, I didn't. I didn't technically name her, but her name is Muffet. If anyone really wants to know, uh, that's pretty much. That's her name. She's kind of crazy. She. Uh, she wants some of Yager's dick. I'm not even joking. <laughs> I'm not even kidding you guys. She wants it hard. But, uh... <laughs> I'm not into BC Alley, so unfortunately for her, it won't happen. Just give me one second, guys. Uh, she wants to leave. But, yes! We lost a gold great woman! Oh, anyway. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm... Oh, still pretty much in the beginning. There's the five kits, there's Assault, there's Demolition, there's Recon, which is Sniper, which some people argue should not be called Recon. There's Support, there's Specialist, which is pretty much you get an Uzi or anything with fast uh, rate of fire and get like um, the Tracer Dart gun and uh, C4. Um, I personally would rather stick to this for right now. But the thing about this game, this the multiplayer is good. But it's completely different if you play Bad Company 2, I swear to god. If you play Bad Company 2 and you jump into this game, it's gonna be like relearning the fucking, uh... Relearning the game again, because the game is just so different. 
honestly like the multiplayer in the second one. I think it's a little easier to kill people, but I'll tell you what, this game is a little challenging at first. <clears throat> but you have to stick with it. The multiplayer is fun. The trophies, the achievements for this game is virtually, um, how should I put this? Um, kinda hard, if not improbable for most, or impossible for some, some people. Because uh, it requires you to get all the multiplayer rewards, and for some odd reason, Daisto was nice or awesome to have you have <clears throat> uh, these awards called Stay and Dry Wild Cards, which pretty much they ha they want you to kill 52 enemies in a round. Um, and most people can't even get up to 52. The most I was able to get up to so far was pretty much. Uh, uh, 32, and I was down by, and I, and I was during the time I was trying to get my, uh, 11 kills with two different kits, man, that thing was a fucking grind, let me tell you right now, that shit's trash, honestly guys, I love this game to death, it's one, this is one of the first, first person shooters I played since so, uh, not so calm, but since, uh, Rainbow Six Tom Clancy back in the PlayStation 1 days, that is a long ass time, obviously since this game I played Killzone 2, Killzone 3, Bad Company 2, so I'm a little more familiar with the first person shooter, uh, uh, get games and all that stuff, and I, I, but this game really tests your skill, I'm not lying, uh, honestly, I've become a lot better at this game since I've played all the other games, it's kind of weird, like, it's, you obviously have to, uh, you obviously have to train hard and really play good, and, in order to really understand what's going on. Uh, I actually think the angle's pretty good in this. Yeah, I, I like it. I like it a lot. But anyway, um... Uh, uh, look at this! Oh yeah, baby! Tomas Ko Koshiyama? I have no idea how to say that. I probably butchered that fucking name. I don't give a fuck. But you know what? Where's these motherfuckers? I'm gonna kill them. You know what? I'm gonna... Oh shit, this thing's out of, uh... I'm gonna go back and go attack their, uh... <clears throat> attack their base. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna ho I'm hope... I'm hoping to make these videos a little more personal to talk about really what's going on. I told you guys I'm trying to look for a new computer. Charge is armed! Move, move, move! Oh shit. Ah, I got killed by Tiny Huevos in a helicopter, so I'm one for one, eh, fuck. But anyway, I'm hoping to make this series, or <clears throat> this random series, multiplayer session, I'm hoping to really talk about some personal Target stuff TQ. and uh, what's been going on. I, like I told you guys, I'm trying to get a new computer because I personally feel that I need to step my game up. That's right, baby. Step your game up. Marcus, that's baby, right? Hang in there, soldier. He's he's inspiring to me. I love him. Not really, not really, but uh, but yeah, I you know I really think I need to step my game up with this quality stuff. I know I've been talking about it for quite a while, but I'm not really happy with uh, recording with camera, despite the fact that I know I have to use what I have right now. What the fuck does this guy think he is, man? Look at this guy. And don't mess with me, that's all I have to say. Of course, I get killed by a tank shooting the oil tanks. Thank you. Thank you, tanks. Fucking bastards, man. But, uh, yeah, you know. I'm still trying to figure out what, uh, what I want to do. I found this monster, monster processor that I really would love to, to base my new computer on. Oh, shit, this motherfucker. Oh, look at this. I'm a real gangster, son. You don't fuck with me. Charge is on. Charge is on. Go, 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 go. Oh, come on! How did I? Man, I don't know how the fuck I managed to die there, but yeah, I found this monster process. I really want to try to get. Um, I'll probably attach it to this video. Um, in the description. 
I really want you guys' input. I really want I want you guys to really get involved in these videos. I know I keep saying this, but I we lost. Go green go one. one, two, one. That's how you do it, baby. That's how you do it, baby. So real gangsters do it. Look at that. Look at that handiwork. Whoa, what the fuck? Wait, where's these enemies? I know there's enemies around here. Ah, oh, look at that leap of faith, man. It's so hot. Uh. Oh, shit. Some people don't like tanks in multiplayer. I actually think it adds a different element. It fucking is annoing though when you, when the requirements requ when uh, where some of the rewards require you to get a certain amount of kills with a certain amount of vehicles and all that stuff. But yeah. <clears throat> but anyway, I really want you guys to really get involved in these videos. I'm really asking for you guys to really get involved. I mean, I want you guys to think about what you think about this processor. If you really think I should go get it. Or I should go get something a little smaller. Um, it's a Sandy Bridge processor. Charge is armed. The power go, of this go. thing is like 3.4 gigahertz, and it's a, it's an i7. I've heard go Sandy Bridge is pretty big uh, beast uh, processor, and uh, you should definitely go get it. I've heard from someone I should definitely go get that, but. <clears throat> I heard from someone else that I should probably look into getting a better graphics card if I want to play games like uh, Killing Floor and obviously, you know, Minecraft, I don't really need a beast video card. I do need RAM though. I tell you guys right now, I bought Minecraft, um, but I, my PC cannot fucking run it. It's a weird thing, like, it. You would think with the performance tweaks that, that you can use for slower PCs, you can actually play it, but not mine. My PC is so shit that it cannot run it, even with the performance tweaks, without it lagging. So, that's actually bad news on my part. I, I'm really am disappointed. And I had a feeling this shit was going to happen too, but I just wanted to see maybe if I was lucky enough. I know this isn't a lot of action here, but... This uh, this is not the type of match so far that's been all in your face uh, action as I would like. <clears throat> but, but I figured this is a good time to start talking about stuff I really want to go get into. Okay, where is this motherfucker? Come on, man. Yeah! What now, Rolling Robert? What the fuck now? <laughs> but, um... But yeah, so tell me what you think about this processor. Tell me if anyone knows anything about computers. You think I should go after it? You think I should base my new computer on this monster processor, or should I go a little bit step lower and hope and get a just get a? Damn it! Why can I hit this guy? I will kill you. Sniper. Yes, Sniper. I killed you. Damn it, who's fucking shooting me, man? So I got six kills. That usually means I got six kills with this uh, weapon. Oh shit! Oh shit! A headshot? It's pretty legit. I knifed you, buddy. Oh man, I'm rocking right now. I am rocking. Uh, that I could have went there and. Uh, Disabled that shit, but I decided not to. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, tell me what you think about this beast computer. You think uh, beast processor? If you think you want, want me to go go get it, if you know anything about computers, uh, go right ahead. <clears throat> if you think this will last me um, for years to come, because right now I think this processor is the premier i7 processor. I'm pretty sure it's one of the premier top of the line processors, and it's not bad price to be quite honest. It's actually 300 bucks 
Uh, I no, actually, I think it's 3:30. I think. But uh, yeah, so tell me what you think. If you actually go after it, um, tell me what you think. I'll post a, I'll leave the link onto my comments, and not the comments on the description, and just tell me what you think.